The Export to Excel option, located in the File pull-down menu, allows you to export recorded data into a Microsoft Excel spreadsheet. As you can see, there are three export options. We can export a number of data points after the cursor, export data between the time marker and cursor, or export the entire file. First we'll take a look at the points after cursor option. The cursor is the black vertical line that runs from the top to the bottom of the waveform browser window. To reposition the cursor, left click and hold in the annotation strip at the bottom of the window and drag the cursor left or right. When exporting points after the cursor, position the cursor at the beginning of the area of interest and specify the number of points after or to the right of the cursor. When exporting data between the time marker and cursor, place a time marker at the beginning of the area of interest and move the cursor to the end. To insert a time marker, choose Enable Time Marker from the Options pull-down menu or use the F4 shortcut key. As you can see, the position of the time marker is indicated by a blue vertical line on channel 1. Data between the time marker and cursor is exported to Excel. You can also choose to export the entire file. The only limitation here is the maximum number of rows in Microsoft Excel. That's well over a million rows with Excel 2013. Additional tabs allow you to include custom timestamp and event columns in the spreadsheet, specify a worksheet, or add spreadsheet comments.